What's up guys and girls, Lazy Dragon here, and it's time for us to spend some time in Porsche, in my time at Porsche. Congratulations game, you have passed the name check. You wouldn't believe how many titles fall down at that first hurdle. So first things first, before we go into Stardew Valley, but we're going to need a character. And if it's a choice between bowl cut lad or very short female, I'm going to have to go for the female. Bowl cuts are no. Bowl cuts are very bad. <laughs> Instant turn off, even in a farming game. Perfect, that should do it. We've called ourselves Old Farmer, because there's a, a limit on the number of characters you can have, because this is apparently a fucking Pokemon game from 2001. And we've, uh, yeah, we've maxed out every slider on the face meters bars thing. <laughs> this is what happens when you turn brow position, eyebrow shape, and brow thickness to maximum. Look at it, she has a pair of goddamn melons on her head. Just slices of melon up there. And that's to say nothing of her nose, <laughs> which is just perfectly circular. Wow, this is... This is gonna be a nightmare. <laughs> she's gonna be hiding under your bed tonight. Old oh, farmer, she's gonna be coming for you. Ooh, a boat and a seagull! Lad's gonna poop on us. That's a wonderful start to the game. Hello, Portian citizens. Please ignore the giant mound of bird shit in my hair. Woo woo. The <laughs> Wait, the driver of the boat is named Woo Woo. <laughs> oh, poor man. Suddenly calling myself Old Farmer doesn't seem so silly. Now, everyone else in Portia lost in a game of Scrabble when it came to their names. Fucking Woo Woo. <laughs> She seems so happy. Look, at his nose is even bigger than ours. How? I maxed out the sliders. Does he have a cheat code for nose size? Is that the trade-off? He goes through life being called Woo Woo, but he knows cheats that nobody else does. He's also a billionaire. <laughs> That's the price he has to pay. Billionaire, but a nose large enough to snort the entirety of Switzerland in one good go. Ooh, old farmer. Yep, this is going to go well. Presley, how do you do? Why are we so posh? No, look at her. She's clearly inbred. She, she would be the rejected bastard child. How is she so well-spoken? Good to see you. Hope you had a pleasant journey from Barnarock. Which sounds like a festival exclusively for farmers. They get their barns, and then they have a rock show. Anyway, I'm here to show you to your workshop. Ooh, ooh. They didn't have that in Stardew or in Harvest Moon. This is interesting. I was just going to make um, Friends of Mineral Town references the entire time. Maybe I'll have actually have to work for my jokes for once. No one's been working there since your pa left Porsche. Ah, uh, and now we just so happen to inherit it. It's probably haunted, or you know, blown up. Why else would they just give a workshop away? So where are we going? Dash. What do you mean dash? I can sprint. I can run. Can I dodge roll? I want, no, don't tell me where to go. I want to dodge roll. Do the, do the Legend of Zelda thing. Let me roll my way across Hyrule Field. <sighs> really? That's our workshop? <laughs> Apparently we're living in Porsche's doghouse. What do I think of it? Yeah, it looks shit. Oh, it looks homey. Yeah, it's more diplomatic. It looks very, um, it, it's definitely a place. It's the best thing I can really say about it. Here's a letter from your father. He asked me to present it to you when you've seen this house. Does the letter just say, ha ha, this piece of shit's yours now. Good luck dealing with it. Because that's the sort of letter I'd leave. <laughs> Old Farmer. Remember, this is her dad talking to her. The same person who gave her the name Old Farmer. Imagine being a baby. Going to nursery and being called Old Farmer. Ah, uh, if that's not destiny, I don't know what is. Then again, I suppose with a name like Old Farmer, you don't really have a choice. You get to grow up to be one thing, and it sure as shit is not an artist. And when you read this letter, I will already be on the other side of the world. Sorry about that. He don't sound sorry. <laughs> he's having a wonderful holiday, and he's left us with this shack. I'm sorry, I'm not your father you wanted me to be. This was so sudden, so I didn't have much time to tell you. 
Then I thought about this workshop. It might not look like much now, but it will brace you from the wind, he claims. It looks like it will fall down in a stiff breeze. I suppose we'll have to put that to the test. What's the cheat code for tornadoes in this game? <laughs> Konami code, right? Up, up, down, down. Uh, I have left my workshop handbook the details how to... The details how I created things in my workshop. The rest is up to you. Do your best and live a wonderful life. Uh, Harvest Moon reference. You will always. Is that the end of the letter? What? <laughs> Did he get attacked by a bear before he could finish writing? You will always what? Where were you going with that? You will always be saddled with this fucking shit? Is, is that what you're trying to get, get, get across? That's it, no, no explanation, nothing on the other side of the letter. Cool, thanks. Uh, we, we, oh, we need a building license as well? Christ, look at all this bureaucracy. All I wanted to do was inherit a nice little farm. Now here I am jumping through hoops for a civil service of an island I've never heard of. This, this is a fun, wholesome game. Oh hey, achievements. Suddenly my complaints have disappeared. <laughs> Everything is wonderful now. Give me more imaginary numbers. Day two, month one, year one. How long is that bed? Seriously, is bloody Stretch Armstrong supposed to be sleeping in there? Look, when she gets up, you'll see why I'm complaining. She does not need a pet that long. It's four times the size of her. Oh, Christ, you may as well sleep in a bouncy castle. Oh, my head hurts. I didn't sleep well at all from the breeze coming through the cracks. I was right, it doesn't keep the wind out. That letter lied to us. But how do, how do we know this is even his workshop? How do we know he didn't just steal it from someone? What's this? Fix this gap. Okay. Requires 20 wood. And we have nothing to our name, apart from our winning smile. Yep. Technically a winning smile. It's how we win at poker. Everyone else gets scared off and runs away. And that counts as a victory for me. Home panel. Furniture? You can gain attributes by putting furniture in your house. Why? <laughs> Are you telling me I get power-ups depending on what sort of sofa I have? That is a very weird mechanic. Stop harvesting crops. Done. Stop adding for Done. I've done all of this. <laughs> can we tick all of these things off, please? Because I, I'm not doing anything right now. I've stopped production of the entire farm. Help our log. That's empty. Cool. <laughs> we got no help and apparently our table will be giving us a power boost in the future. This is a very strange game indeed. Uh, glowing objects are collectible resources. What glowing objects? The mailbox? You have got a letter. You have got a letter from Porsche Times. Fancy. Hello, new subscriber. No, I did not click that little bell. I should not be subscribed to the Porsche Times. Although, if you want to subscribe to Lazy Dragon, go ahead and click that button under the video, you know? Help a brother out. A brother who is currently pretending to be a very strange-looking female. This is the Porsche Times. We are sponsored by the city government and the local Commerce Guild branch to bring you the latest news for free. Wow, that means it's going to be absolutely shite quality. Yeah, there was an event the other day, but I'm not getting paid enough to write about it. We are a monthly publication. Oh, there we go. <laughs> they only have funding for 12 issues a year. Wow. <laughs> so glad I'm subscribed to these guys. If you have any questions or concerns, please visit our office. Because they have nothing else to do for 30 days every month. <laughs> All they do is sit around waiting for people to come and say hello. They're very lonely up there. I can't move. What is happening? Okay, those are letters. Cool. So, well now what? Go to the commerce guild. Oh, I don't want to go to the commerce guild. There's a thing. Let me open the thick. Really? You have hands. Why did you feel the need to kick the box? Why, why was there boxing gloves in there? Well, I have questions. Who are you? Pinky. Where's Brain, Pinky? Relationship plus one. Chat. Sure, I'll chat up Bagpus. Why not? Meow. What a wonderful conversationalist Bagpus is. Bagpus, <laughs> I would offer you something, but unfortunately I don't have any bears, cakes, 
all weird and mystical gemstones. I'll see you later, Bagpus. I'll be back to play. Apartments. With a giant happy sign next to it. I'm guessing that's false advertising. Right, now where am I going? Commerce Guild. Wow, they must be reeking him. Look at the size of that building. G oh, no, 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 no. There's two of her on screen. That, that's too much. Old Farmer. Far too much Old Farmer. Nice to see you, Old Farmer. Sorry that some random woman with a cupcake on her head just walked in between us. Apparently everyone in this town is very rude. Oh, uh, we're, we're not feeling so well, you know. <laughs> we didn't sleep because our house has giant sodding holes in it, and then I found a cat and he didn't want to talk to me. Hang in there. Let me introduce you to the Commerce Guild. You can pay them all of your money, and in exchange you too can get a really dumb looking haircut. The organisation that orchestrates trade across the entire Free Cities region. And I, I wish I knew this Porsche law. I feel like I've jumped into the third game in a trilogy. There's clearly so much backstory going on here. Who are the Free Cities? What is the Trade Guild? Why does that woman appear to have shaved Bagpus and stuffed his fur on her head as a really badly made wig? Is that why Bagpus didn't want to talk to us earlier? He's wary of humans. It's why he won't show us his belly either. That's where all of the fur was taken from. It's still all shaved and weird looking. Because seriously, shaved cats just look odd. I mean, shaved dogs do as well. Not as scary as shaved bears. Shaved bears are terrifying. Uh, uh, a builder test. Make an axe and a pickaxe. Okay. Let me just go mining. And then I shall do some crafting. And once I've craft mined, we can actually get to the gameplay portion of this game. After I have raw materials, uh, okay, go to a work table which I have raw materials. Find some stuff. Aha! Now where would I find some wood? Probably in a fountain. Hold on, wait a minute. Let me just... Yep, there's a good six inches of water there that we are currently hovering on top of. Looks like old farmer's been around to the block a few more times than we originally believed. Yeah, she was there back in the old Roman days. Jesus has now been reincarnated as a very ugly looking woman farmer. What, what is this? Remember the past so that we might have a better future. What? Church store. No, I need wood. Although, actually, that does make sense that they're here. Thinking about it, they've come to witness the second coming of Jesus, the old farmer. We are their god. We are... <laughs> we are the symbol of everything they believe in. A strange small girl running around with old boxing gloves on. That's the symbol of Christianity, right? It's a good thing we're doing this just before Easter, really. I mean, look at us being all religious and caring about beliefs. Yes, that's what we're doing. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> Glowing objects, ah, now that someone else's ranch looks clearly better than ours. And there's a rocket ship in the back. What is that? All broken down and overgrown? <laughs> like, here we have nice happy harvest moon times, and over there is near automata. Okay. I'll keep my eye out for the android maids that start popping out the woodwork. Currently, what's currently unavailable? Man, I just want some wood. <gasps> I can roll. I can, I can dodge roll in a farming game. Is it, are they setting up for battle royale? My time at Porsche. Is, is that the next step for the game? Why else would they have a dodge roll? In fact, in the game's next update, you'll have to parachute into your house before you can start farming. Oops, we touched the water. Oops, we touched the water again. Okay, apparently we're perfectly fine walking in a fountain, or on a fountain, should I say. Can't do the same on an open body of water. Is, is that what happens when Jesus comes back? His water walking powers get a downgrade? Now we can only walk on a fountain. Kick the tree. There's going to be bees in the tree, isn't there? Bees? Bees. We do need wood. Can I just kick this tree over until I get some wood? 
Ooh, what is this? This is a boss. Oh, look, that's a funky looking thing, isn't it? Hello, Mr. Boss. I would like to get in. Thank you. How do I ride you? Let's climb, climb, jump. J okay, go. And this is a very important life hack for the students of the world. Even if you don't have enough money for a bus, just jump onto the back. You'll get a free ride to wherever you need to go. I'm not actually on the back, I'm hovering six foot in the air. Also a good life hack. If you don't have enough money for a bus, just start flying. Now we're on the roof. Something tells me things have gone very wrong. Oh, he does move, but only when I'm jumping. Okay, <laughs> this is how we get into our destination now. Just gotta keep ourselves hovering up there. Just... <laughs> it's slow, but it'll get you, get you there. It's a good little runner like that. Colourful armour, yes it is. I can fight a llama. I can fight a rainbow llama. I'm... Tr wow! Here I thought it was nice happy farming fun times and here we are drop kicking an alpaca. In order to get some animal feces. Cool. That's wonderful. Why is poop one of the items that they drop? Why? Why is that a thing? How about you? Do you drop anything when I hit you? Oh, what the... I can't hurt old ladies, but I can hurt llamas. What sort of blatant discrimination is this? Capture menu. I can capture the llamas. Colourful llama. Oh my god, the cotton llama. Look at him. Look at him. He's wearing sunglasses despite being a llama. He doesn't care for society's rules, man. He lives his best life all day, every day. I want to be that llama. That llama is ju He does not give two shits. What an absolute hero. Uh, gather some more rocks. Ga Do I have enough wood now? Maybe. I'm, I'm not sure. Where's this work table I'm supposed to be building things on? Is this it? Craft. Yeah, uh, swords. Wood. I do need wood. Where do I find wood, though? From log and total tools. Where the heck is a... Huh? Where are the logs? Logs of the world, reveal yourself to me. This is a big map. This is bigger than I thought it was. Um, what have we got down here? Plateau? Harbour? Fufalu Desert? <sighs> uh, zoom, 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 zoom. There must be some logs around here somewhere. Ch collapsed wasteland? Sewage plant ruins? Abandoned ruins number two? Wow, they have so many abandoned ruins in this part of the world. Church, construction, school... Hey, I can dropkick a child. That's something to look forward to. Civil Corps, or join the militia. Probably as punishment for dropkicking a child. The round table? What the heck is going on in this game? Everything is here! <laughs> Ooh, tree farm. That must be where I go for trees. Can I mark it? Yes, I can. <laughs> I figured out where to find some wood, and it only took me about 12 hours. Shut up. <laughs> I was exploring. You can't complain at me for having a bad work ethic. I was looking at all of these lovely, lovely um, bits of corn. That's my excuse. Yes, we'll ignore the two hours or so I spent slowly jumping up and down on a bus. Like a rejected teen wolf. Ooh, horse. Can I ride the horse? Fine. Oh, sheep. Can I ride the sheep? Hey, little sheepy. Hey, little... Why do the animals in this game not want to let me ride them? All I want to do is ride around on a sheep. It's not too much to ask for, is it? And also, you know, find some wood. And walk on water again. And ride a llama. And teach that bus driver a lesson. Is that a rabbit wearing a hat? Illusion bunny. 
I feel like I've stumbled into a really bad episode of Yu-Gi-Oh. Gammy, I'm gonna put my fists in attack mode. Take this illusion bunny. He's not even fighting back. Oh, illusion bunny. What are you gonna do? Wait, where's your magic now? Hey, two for the price of one. I have double summoned an illusion bunny. No, I don't know where I'm going with this. Apparently where I'm going is straight to the game over screen. Well, looks like our time at Porsche has come to a, a swift and violent end at the hands of a rabbit in a top hat. <laughs> so thank you all for joining me. This has been my time at Porsche. We might come back and try to play it properly. Or we might come back and get beaten up by another small woodland creature. Who knows? If you've got a game you'd like to see played on this channel, feel free to leave it in the comments down below. And until next time, farewell everyone.